In Revelation chapter 7, there's a verse that says, The Lamb will be their shepherd. He will lead them to springs of living water, and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. And in Psalm 23, we see Jesus as a shepherd. Oh, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. One day when my kids were small, I was tucking them into bed, and one of them popped out with a question from Psalm 23. We had just been reading it, and they were asking, Mom, how can a shepherd be a lamb? What a wonderful truth. And that prompted a lot of thought and this song. I thought my girl asleep in bed, but found her wide awake instead. I caught her peeking up at me, saying, Mama, would you answer me? There's something that I think about, something I can't figure out. I know a shepherd is man. How can a shepherd be a lamb? Today I heard Psalm 23. You read aloud the words to me. In there it says, I am the lamb, and Jesus is my shepherd man. But Jesus Christ is also called a sacrifice, a lamb of God. Oh, Mama, I don't understand. How can my shepherd be a lamb? Oh, honey girl, you know it's true. The shepherd watches over you. With greenest grass, he keeps you fed. And by still waters, you are led. Your soul's restored to God again, no matter what you've done or been. When you trust in Christ, the shepherd man, for your shepherd is the great I am. How better can he show his care than as a lamb your sins to bear? Who better than a shepherd can know just how to be a lamb? Christ was spotless, perfect, pure. His death has made for sin a cure. And though we may not understand, the shepherd is our sacrificial lamb. Who better than this shepherd can know just how to be?